Oh, we're happy to be home. Uh, I think we played pretty well, uh, especially at, at times against uh, NNU and Central Washington. And I think uh, those two games uh, were uh, tough enough on the road that it helped prepare us for two very good opponents coming into, uh, coming into Alaska this weekend. So we're excited to get back at home and uh, play some very good teams here on Thursday and Saturday. about the team at this point compared to a year ago? Um, you know, it's a completely different team. I think offensively, at times, we are, are pretty good. Maybe not quite as good as we were last year, but defensively, along you know, with Kyla's, uh, you know, Kyla's improved a lot from her freshman year. Uh, and our defense maybe is a little bit better than it was last year at this time. You know, it's hard to tell, uh, but we, we've learned that we are very competitive, you know, obviously in the GNAC and uh, maybe more so than we thought we'd be uh, at the beginning of, you know, at the beginning of the year. And that's a testament to the newcomers and the improvement of the, the returners. So do you think that that your strong defense is what has been, what's been carrying you? You know, early in the season, I think so. I think the offense has, uh, you know, has done what's what's been necessary to to get wins. Uh, you know, we lost three big hitters last year, and trying to replace those was those hitters. Trying to replace those, that was a concern for the coaching staff. And you know, I think the freshmen that have come in and uh, done a great job, and you know, offensively tried to fill some pretty big shoes, have done a, you know have done done well enough and. You know, I think we have room to improve offensively yet. I, th I think we're going to become a better offensive team as the season continues. Uh, defensively, hopefully, we can become a little bit better too. But uh, yeah, defensively, I think early on, especially, that's kind of what's been carrying us. Um, speaking of defense, I think nationally you guys are ranked fifth in blocks. Um, I know it's got to be an area that you, you would be impressed with. Um, I, I guess, what do you do in practice to maybe focus <laughs> on? I mean, if there's something you know that kind of sets you up for that kind of success. Uh, you know, I don't know. We, we do work, work a lot on blocking schemes, and we prepare for each opponent, trying to figure out how each opponent's hitter will, will hit in the games by looking at past performances. So we, th we like to think that we prepare well and try to take away their best shot, and, uh, and the girls do a good job executing those game plans. I guess my question for you would kind of be the same just talking about the defense of the team if you you know are missing those big hitters do you feel more comfortable being a defensively strong team than an offensively offensively strong team uh yes i do feel more comfortable like how our coaches say um offense like gets the tickets and defense wins the championships and so yeah like i think it's great because we get to be really scrappy and hold like um, we get to do the rallies like longer and so yeah. And from a year ago, where would you say that this team, this year's team has gotten stronger and, may, and, where, and where it needs to improve? From a year ago, I think the teams are kind of like it's hard to say like how coach says it's kind of hard to say whether or not we're better this year or last year but I do agree with coach how he says that we can be better offensively and defensively defensively I think one thing we can work on is uh, I mean getting more blocks I know we're ranked fifth but it's always a good thing to get blocks because we always try to get more blocks than the other teams and the fact that you know you got this streak going in any sort of pressure? No, I don't think we feel any pressure. We take it one game, one team at a time. So I think we prepare well for the teams that are upcoming. And I don't really think that we like shy away from pressure. Do you think that the streak has kind of made you guys maybe more comfortable? Like you know that you can fall back on all these wins. If you lose a game, it's like that's fine because we've won this many straight. Yeah, uh, I no, I think we should go out with every game. Like 
hoping to win, thinking that we're going to win. I mean, losing is hard to take. And when we did lose against, I think, Shamanad, Shamanad, it was really tough on us. <laughs> I know. It was really tough on us. And I mean, we just got to take it one game at a time. Win or lose, we want to uh, we want to lose by you giving our 110 percent. So then in that sense, do you think your loss against Shamanad, you said it was really tough. I mean, it seems, would you say that this is a team that can take loss and take adversity and turn it into wins? You know, I do think that because um, the thing that really held us back against that game was our offense. And after that loss, we hit the gym, we came back home, worked harder than ever. I think our hitters have really improved since then. Anytime you string together 19 wins in a row um, and you're able to bounce back from a loss, like what does that say about your guys' chemistry that continues to build like week after week then? I think our chemistry is really good. We bond on and off the court. We're really close off the court, and I think that's like the major key to our, our wins, I guess, our success throughout the season.